Today I wanted to talk about treadle belts. So, domestic treadle belts in this case. And I've tried two types. Um, this is quite common, and it's sort of a brown color, but it's flat. So if you get your treadle belt perfectly in place, it's not a problem. However, what I have always found is that it's easy to get a kink, a twist in it. And then as that goes round and round and round, you don't get a very smooth experience. But what I found most frustrating about <clears throat> this flat type, and it's got, I don't know how they make it exactly. It looks like it's got stitches or something to make it secure. But I find this, this type really stretches. And I mean really, really stretches. So I don't get very long out of this style of belt. So even though they're very common, it's acceptable. But I find it's not got a very long lifespan because it tends to stretch. And then <clears throat> where this hook joins it, <clears throat> it, always, it tears. And once it tears, it, it's kind of... You can shorten it a few times, but after that you end up having to stick a couple of them together and then they stretch. So it's not been my favorite experience. Um, I've seen quite a few people with this style. And this type is round. don't know exactly how it's manufactured, but it, it, it's very interesting. And I found this one stretches far less um, and doesn't seem to tear as much. So on the whole, I found this type to be, though harder to find, not hard to find, but harder to find, less common, I find this round type much more accept acceptable experience, lasts longer. Plus, if it's slightly twisted, it doesn't matter because it, it's round, so it just keeps going round. So to me, this type is far preferable. So if you can find this round type, I would highly recommend it.